a cam this game, people. He's going to be getting some nasty headshots. Oh, great. Really? Yeah, just sort of still... Yep, here it is. We are going live, folks, and it is going to be a hell of a game. Right away, it does look like we both have... We have both medics running medigun, which is, you know, fairly usual. Nothing too strange going into the first mid. Um, Looks like special. RJ will Ooh. get here first. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, right Justify getting in very early, doing a nice jump. We do have a scout over on the DK side running milk, so that's pretty interesting. Uh, Spade Sentry Gun goes down fairly early right here, and actually DK is pushing in very aggressive. Ooh, very nice pick there by Bobby, taking down um, uh, Carson really early right there. Pipa also got a pick in that mid fight as well. And, and Smile's picking up the last member of the combo, so this is going to be mid fight for DK right here. Um, solid play from the Assassin classes of uh, Dunning Kruger. Absolutely. Even though both team managers managed to get in first, had that early um, sort of jump in, it didn't seem like they were really following up. And those spy picks, especially initially, were great. Aegis right there got finished off by Smiles. We have a soldier battle going on on concrete. Doesn't look like anybody's going to be the best of that. But worth noting, both medics did make it out alive. Both have 100% uber. We should be looking for something happening soon. And Corsa did take down right justify. So, uh, both team really has their work really cut out for this. Spring Rolls gets taken down there, and Smiles, Smiles actually had shot on the course up. as well. And so, it's really on uh, both team right now to push in, but they have to wait for a right justify get. Oh, fusion! Nice shot from Bora right there. Bora is in such a powerful position right now. The pocket spot that's next to the right side, as I say, that he gets picked by Smiles, but such a oh good spot God, for snipers. I'm sorry, but double stab by Vipa, that's really good. H is going down there, and uh, Skis... Skis going down the smiles. smiles. That's so good. Um, we do have Boat Team running across the point right now. A bit of carnage going on on the side of DK. It doesn't look like anybody's going to be able to contest this. Corsa and Van go down as well. That's going to be an easy cap. Um, but there are a lot of spawns coming up for DK right now. It doesn't look like Bobby got anything, got caught out there by Fusion. Um, doing a nice little a bit of handy work right there. So we are getting a little bit of spam from the DK side, but we aren't going to be seeing any sort of exchange happening anytime soon. Ooh, Ouch. Smiles has been going off this so, so far. Another shot into Aegis. That's down, uh, that spam fest and Aegis down. Those are huge picks. Because that's going to open up the flank completely, and Colster is just going to be sitting in this corner. Uh, here's the Uber from Red Team going out. Uh, looks like they're gonna clean up Carl and only get Bobby. This is not the best Uber, I would think, from, uh, Boat coming out, so... TK's just gonna back up, build their Uber, and then push right back in, and... Red will not have the Uber to contest this. Absolutely, they're gonna have to be really choosy in, uh, where they want to hold, just because they're gonna be so vulnerable without that Uber backing them up. Fusion did get taken down there by Boar. Really nice, and we do have a repush coming in from DK. They're going to take this point fairly handily, as it does look like Boat opted to sort of back out, which was smart of them. Naturally, they're going to be up on Cliff, holding a bit right there. We do have the Soldier Aegis. He's jumping around, maybe trying to do a bit of spam in, but it's not going to be happening soon. But uh, Coldster is approaching Uber. He's at 85% and building very steadily. So if we get a fourth in, here comes the button. Oh my god! Skis that goes drop. down! Right going huge! Dropping skis! Might be getting a backstab right there. But right, Justify Bobby going in, picking right, off Uber's the in. team They're demo going as in the well. cleanup Let's on the frags. Uh, Absolutely. Fusion won't be able to get anything, but it looks like Red's going to recap this right after. Carl on the rock and just going to get shut down. Or missing the shot. Boar, you got to land these shots! Oh. Rainbow's taking out spades as well. Boar gets taken out by Fusion, rushing him down Red hasn't right capped there. the point. No, they have not. They got really close. They Finally, just got it does look like um, right, Justify is going to get his butt on that point. And uh, they're going to be able to defend this at least a little bit. And they do have a slight bit of uber advantage just from that drop. Ooh, ouch. Boar nice shot. headshotting Penguin right there. That was a nice thing. Bobby's doing a really good job, actually, of getting in here. He gets uh, caught out by Fusion. The root push is coming in from DK. They're getting a bit more aggressive right here. Looks like DK is just going to push right across the point, use their DM, and just recap this point. This is not what, D uh, what Boat needs right now. There's a lot of free caps, but they can't do anything. Right, Justify in a bit of a pickle, but looks like he's going to get out. Escapes from behind house, and the red team's just trying the gear. Uh, Colster has Uber, and he's ready to go. Right, Justify's moving up, and we can expect a red Uber possibly really soon. And here it is. They pop Fusion, and they're going to pick off Carl, and looks like Fusion's going and trying to chase frags. Blue Uber popped right after, and they're cleaning up, Boar picking off spring rolls, and Blue Superior Uber.
And Smiles gets taken up by Bobby! Yeah, Bobby was doing a really great job. He was behind enemy lines. He was in position with that ambassador. And we have just a really great repush from DK going down. Just, ooh, right justify Carson and Spades down, as well as Viper being caught out there by Spamfest. And so that's going to be a really nice repush. And they only have to hold this point for 15 seconds. That is not enough time. We're going to probably see some maybe desperate attempts to get on this point anytime soon as only 10 seconds and even if a boat manages the cap they have to hold on for it for a minute 20 spring rules gets absolutely wasted by have to get right on the point it's taken up. and here we go on to the point right justify doing his best not quite getting on there in the first round, round one to dk in a very um decisive manner mind you all right i'm gonna watch course on this rel up because their team followed up way better with course's damage than right justify's damage rj will get there first and we'll get the he'll miss the sticky and of course is just getting in position throwing over some spam and looks like not too much happening a just getting taken down by smiles good shot from him let's see if the flight can oh, push bobby off that button. bobby can't bobby can't oh my god later cold, cold star. Star. oh my god getting that 2k on coldster and ray justify he just won his team this mid guaranteed oh that was awesome Great play from Bobby right there, taking down the combo from Boat right there, and Smiles trying to go for a hero play, can't do it as just getting gunned down. That was a huge, huge play coming from Bobby. Um, who would have thought that would happen? Oh my just God, a 2k on the combo right there, right when I'm thinking, oh, this is going to be Boat's, uh, Boat's mid the win, it just suddenly changes the entire dynamic. Great stabs. Penguin getting picked up, but Bobby also falling, so one for one. Let's see what uh, either team can do. Viper's getting behind them right now. It's moving up onto Cliff, it looks like, but he gets caught out. Yeah, for sure. We are getting a little bit more aggression, but it's that Uber. DK has that Uber to hold on to. They can use it defensively. They can use it to, you know, really just sort of hold on to that Ooh, point. All they have to do is smiles. defend. Yeah, absolutely. And both snipers have actually been doing all right. We do have Penguin getting caught out there by both Carl and the blue team's scout. So we are just seeing sort of... Ooh! Out! down. Fusion getting absolutely latered by Boar right there, sort of a body shot in the middle of the air, in the middle of a jump going Ooh, on. Right Justify down. getting picked up by Boar, who's on a four kill streak. Good job there. Um, Spring Rolls Smiles finally does catch out Carl. Bobby, and uh, Carl is down as well, as you mentioned. And finally, we have the DK Uber coming out fairly aggressively before Coldstar has a chance to get his. He's managing to make it out. Carson, however, is down. Spades gets taken down and as Boar well by Coulster. And... Ooh, yeah, um, Corsa gets taken out by Penguin, sort of, didn't, wasn't able to back out right there, and Colster does have shine. an Uber to get nice in snap. here. Nice snap from, uh, Viper right there, taking down Van. Hey, he's just going for a bomb! On Colster, can't get anything with it! Ooh, uh, that was a close bomb. One rocket just went a little bit too into the wall. It hit the wall, so he was able to land too. That was almost, uh... That was almost a drop right there, but no such luck. Looks like red team's going to cap the point. Boat holding uh, passively. Smiles behind rock taken down, and that's going to signal the push coming in from DK immediately. And are we on a pause? I believe we are on a pause. Looks so. Interesting. I wonder why. Um, we do have a repush coming in from DK right now. Holster, of course, is going to have time to pop an Uber to defend this, unless they manage to get a good pick. Onto him. I really doubt that, however. He's pretty decent at holding onto his Uber from what I've seen from him previously. So, let's talk about uh, what just uh, transgressed right there. Transgressed? Blah, blah, blah. Cannot speak. So, let's talk about what just happened. Um, it looks like Boar might have caught word about what I was saying, about him trying to pick it up, and he has been going ham as of late. Getting so many picks and just being a brick wall. Boat cannot push into Boar right now, and it's killing them so it's going to be blue team recapping the point nothing that boat can do to prevent point and do you think fusion's going to survive in the position he's in um fusion i out in the open right next to van yeah no probably not especially not with a heavy looking at him as well if he manages to back up or at least get into that little um health pack room on concrete maybe but he's just he's a sitting duck out here yeah, um, let's see here, um, the positioning for their players, nobody is behind DK right now, looks like, uh, Viper is dead, oh, we're back. On pause. Absolutely, hey. right over here, Fusion's um, Red Uber is back. Yeah, the Red Uber does get popped, and it does look like Boat is, is moving across point, 
right now. They do manage to defend it so far. And uh, right justify is alone right here on point. He meets up with the medic, and oh my god, Bobby dropping down, almost getting that pick, but getting absolutely wasted. And here we go, DK pushing back in here, trying to get something happen. Oh, shut down, Bork on him. Oh, that is so good. But uh, Viper gets Bora right there in that exchange as well. And finally, the recap goes in for DK, and uh, both teams gonna have to back up and wait for their medic, or at least send in somebody to sack for um, Skis right now, because Skis has Uber, and uh, that's pretty decent on this map. Thankfully, not many people on boat died. They managed to stick alive and stay alive through that, which was good on them, but they really need to figure what they're going to do for this next push. I'm curious to see what RJ is going to do here, because a lot of this uh, goes onto his shoulders. He oh, never Bobby, mind, he gets backstabbed. Bobby, oh my god, just decloaking in the middle of everybody and roasting him. He is playing some nasty spy today, and I am loving it, that's for sure. We have um, a lot of spam just raining, spam, excuse me, raining down onto the boat team combo. Uh, Colster is sort of doing a little dance smiles right here. Goes down. Yeah, of course, I take down Smiles with some nice sticky. We're getting a bit more aggressive right here from boat team. RJ is moving up towards the rock area with his medic, and Colster is approaching Uber right about now. So we're just going to see who gets the advantage out of what's going to go out, go down here fairly soon. And we do have Fusion dancing around on point. He is. There we go, he gets Uber. He's moving across point. Nobody's trapped it yet, but he goes deep and the counter Uber happened, gets air blasted back. Uh, Billy Sora is doing a good job of reflecting that. Spring Rolls gets taken down, Spamfest taken down by Viper. There are three seconds left on the clock. Somebody needs to cap, and oh my god, it is Carson trying to get on. He they manages. get the point back, but just chaos going on on the point right now. This is not looking too good for DK. Age is going down right there. Nice shot from Smiles, and Boat's got to hold this for two minutes if they want to, but I don't know if they can. Um, it, DK, they look like a well-oiled machine right now, and it's just... Can't, how long can Boat hold on to this? With Boar looking on Cliff right now, can't hit Smiles, will go to China. It's a matter of time. Absolutely. Carson, uh, excuse me, excuse me, Coldstar has a little bit of Uber advantage working in his favor right now, but they literally cannot let DK cap. They need to get more aggressive. They need to make sure that DK cannot set foot on that point. And here we go. The Uber does get popped out onto right, Justify, and Fusion. But there are a lot of frags going right and left. Boar's down. Aegis is down. The Viper and Spring Rolls as well. Both Spies and Snipers getting some nice work done right there. Right, Justify is on the point. DK is completely pushed back right now. But they have an Uber to defend this with. Or excuse me, to aggress this with. Pardon me. Uh, Bobby does get caught out by Spades right here in the backfield. And the DK Uber does move on point. And Oh, right, just like it's absolutely wasted by Corso with a really nice pipe going on right there. And Carson doing his best with the Tommy Salt, trying to get people off this point. And it's just, oh, Spring Rolls trying his best, but just not being able to air blast people off or do enough damage. And that is going to be a second cap for DK. And we are 2 0 right now. Too little, too late, I'm afraid, right there. It was a great valiant effort from Boat, but there's not a lot you can do when there's still two minutes you have to hold on to and the other team's in overtime. So let's see how this mid transgresses. Uh, ooh, not good for Viper. He gets milked immediately, so he's going to force off. So no spy pressure. Penguins going in get picked, but Boar down and Carl down. Let's see what Boat can do with that. Those are two good picks. And oh, Colster buddy. gets picked! Oh my god, Colster down by the spy's knife for the second mid in a row. Uh, Carson is alone, 61 health, he's trying to do his best right there, Smiles get a, gets a nice headshot onto Van, and a domination, it is worth noting, but, yo, Skis made it out alive, Skis has 88% Uber, and they're just gonna be able to re-push this like nobody's business. Yeah, not the best mid fight for Boat right there, good that they got the, the, the midpoint for the first time, they got it, and it's all theirs, but expect the blue Uber, Skis is moving up with Corsa, and just trying to get a bit of spam, trying to get a pick. Or goes down the smiles, and that's a good sign. And Bobby's gonna pick off smiles? No. Ooh, no. This is not uh, looking good. Viper gets a nice pick onto Aegis. Bobby is down. Carl is down as well. But we have an aggressive Uber getting into the boat team's comp. Surprisingly, nobody dies right there. That is a really nice sort of backing up, kiting of that going on. Corsa gets taken out right there by Right Justify. And uh, Billy Source is down as well. Fusion gets caught out, however, by Spamfest. He ran a little bit too far forward, and Coldstar has a pretty significant advantage of about 60% right here to defend this point where they didn't let DK cap. Or they recap, excuse me. That was good. That was really that good. That was really impressive from Boat right there. Uh, only dropping Fusion at the very end of that push, and looks like Blue's gonna re-push right now. 
Uh, they'll get Viper, and now it looks like this push is getting a little better for DK, but here's the Red Uber. They're going in. They won't be able to get skis, so Red's going to have to back off, and Blue will now hold the Uber advantage. They have about 70%, and Picks going into Boat's favor. Carl is down, so it's going to be a little hard to push without him, but Chorus is just going to push off with uh, Vand, and they can't cap the point. There we go. Now they will. Yes, they managed to finally get that, and uh, Coldster is pushed up. He only has 40%, so he's trying to fight this, and here we go. The DK Uber does get popped off from getting really aggressive with course and moving in here trying to find either coldster or right justify doesn't get anyone with that uber so that is a nice backup right there by coldster and his combo they're going to be able to sit over here on cliff and actually carl getting incredibly aggressive gets taken down by right justify right there lots of stickies being thrown out by corsa and um ooh, four getting taken out by viper right there putting some nice pressure onto him that's a nice adjustment going on right there and we are seeing a bit of a soft push. Never mind, hard push as the Uber does get popped out. They got skis. Go. Fusion. Oh, that is so good. Vand, Billysaurus, and Corsa get taken down as well in the post fight. And we are seeing a much better comeback from both team right now. This is a much cleaner look from both. They are absolutely playing off of one another. They're not dropping a lot of numbers. They're playing as a team for, I think, the first time this game. It looks so much better. Uh, huge pick coming in right there from Fusion, the pickup, uh, Ski, so Uber Advantage staying in favor of the red team of Boat, and shout out to Smiles, he's been playing so much better. Here comes the blue push, as I said, Smiles gets picked off and not looking too good for the red team right now, great push coming in, RJ taken down as well. Absolutely, the repush is coming in. It does look like DK is going to be able to cap this, and Carson does get caught out by Carl and a combination of Corsa as well, hitting a nice pipe onto him. Spades gets taken down, and uh, Penguin gets a mini sentry right there, so uh, that that kind of sucks. So <laughs> here we go. DK is on the defensive right now. They have 100% Uber, but they have to hold this for a minute and 50. And if Boat manages to cap, they only have 51 seconds to hold, so that is pretty good. Also, I don't think I've mentioned this, but um. Right Justify is actually running the Iron Bomber, which I've seen a lot of demos running on this map. It's nice to sort of hold down those chokes right there. Aegis gets taken down by Smiles right there. Pretty early on, and the Ubers exchange. are out onto the point, and it does look like there's a lot of bumping faces. Oh my god, I'm sorry. Um, Bobby just sort of uh, <laughs> butter knifed Carson right there. Smiles and Penguin get taken down, and it does look like DK is going to manage to hold onto this point. Um, Coldster did get taken down during after that exchange as well, and War has a really nice headshot onto right justify as well with Fusion getting taken down. So that is a really nice defense as the clock just keeps ticking down, and we're going to be even right now in terms of time soon. Um, that was a super impressive hold. They were able to stop the basically the aggression coming in, and Smiles picks up uh Boar us uh, uh, sorry Boar picks up Smiles right there. If I can get the tongue twister out of my mouth, uh, that was a good shot coming in right there. That's gonna mean that this red team won't be able to really push too well. RJ's trying to make a move right now. He's aggressing on point. He's low on health. He is at three HP right now, and gets the safety. But great hold coming in here from DK. It's not looking too good. Absolutely not. Twenty seconds left down. on the clock. Big bomb coming in here. Getting that force. Good job right there by Penguin, forcing out that Uber. Colts is going to have his Uber in a hot second. So we're going to be seeing a really big repush, and boom, Carson jumping down, picking up that Uber. Bory taking down, Van is down as well. Oh, Viper gets skis too. Carl down, Billy Soros down. That is so good. Like we said, playing as a team right here by Boat Team. And, oh, that is a nice, almost pseudo stair stab on Corsa by Viper as well. They're going to get that recap. Bobby gets caught out as well. And it's 40... Four seconds left on the cap. They cannot let DK cap. DK only has four seconds left to defend this. They need to just make sure that doesn't happen. They either need to cut them off or make sure that Coldster stays alive as Coldster is still going to have that advantage in the form of about 30%. So that is fairly decent. We are seeing a little bit of peppering going on right here. Of course, they're throwing out some stickies, getting a little bit more aggressive with skis right here. And we are seeing some exchanges happening. No frags quite yet. And here we go, tiptoeing onto the point, and the big jump's coming in, trying to force Coldster out, trying to pressure him out right here. Aegis does get taken down, and Carl gets taken down as well. Right Justify finally finding his stickies, and the Uber does come out, getting really aggressive, trying to land something on skis, but he's going to be backing up, but they just have to keep people off of the point. There is zero on the clock right now, nobody can seem to get on it, and that is our first point in favor of Boat Team. We are now 2-1. 
that was a much better round coming in from Boat. Um, I think they figured out some things over the last over the first two rounds, and they applied it into the third round. They take the round, and now we're going back to the mid fight again. RJ getting here before Corsa does, and just applying a little bit of spam, not hitting too much, but uh, Bobby forced to back off, and huge spam coming in right now, actually from um, Right Justified. But Culture gets picked by Boar. Oh my god, that was so good! Uh, Vand is down on the opposing team, Age is down as well. It doesn't look like anybody's going to land anything on skis, nobody is is in position except for Viper. Viper might still get something down, but the uh, boat team is forced to back off as they don't have heals. Carson valiantly staying in here, Viper does get caught out by Vand right there in the backfield. He's not going to be able to get anything down, and actually, nobody capped yet. Um. Nobody is on cab. Finally, it looks like DK is going to get their feet under that and make that happen. Uh, yeah, and here we go. We have the weight going on here as Holster needs to build about like 80% more before he's able to contest right here. Oh, that was a nasty shot from Boar right there. Picking off RJ at the base of Cliff and that's going to delay the push and Smiles goes down. Boar, can't say enough about the guy. He is one of the best snipers we'll ever see. Just what a player. Absolutely. And, and it's definitely nice. <laughs> Later fusion for getting a nice domination onto him. Not something you see every day, that's for sure. Uh, He's Coldster... at four dominations. <laughs> uh, Coldster is approaching 70% right now. Still managing to stay alive. And ooh, big jump coming in here. Forcing out that Uber right justified. Going a little bit huge right there. Nice play. And it does look like both teams going to manage to back up enough and uh bobby is not there to take advantage of it as well as he gets uh picked off right there by fusion so we are going to see coldster ready to push in with his team all they have to do is pick up right just to find they're going to be able to go in uh it does look like carson is going to be able to excuse me going to be caught out right there carl gets caught out as well and then spring rolls gets roasted by corsa in the meantime with some nice stickies and here we go right justify trying to get a little bit aggressive but he's being juggled by corsa it doesn't look like they're making a too much leeway and DK is gonna back off. They know what's going on. They know what game boat team is playing. And oh my God, Bobby, Bobby swinging that knife, trying to make something happen. And it, no, late Coldster makes it out. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Van just got a sword kill. <laughs> I was gonna mention that. <laughs> oh, that's incredible. Um, thank you, thank you. That's just the greatest. And that push was delayed enough that. Uh, Red completely lost their uber advantage. Both medics do have uber once more. Bobby is in position, but uh, it does look like both team is going to pop that uber without anything happening. And the upper counter uber does get caught out. Vipa and Bobby are the only ones who have died so far. And it does look like, oh, Colster valiantly just swinging that uber saw. But Van is going to get him very nicely. And Skeet's made it out. He's still alive. So Boat is going to manage to cap this, but I don't know how long they're going to be able to hold on to it. It looks like Smile, uh, Boar's going on the stairs right now, trying to get a pick. Spring Roll's going up, and I don't know if it's a good idea. Um, that was honestly really, really sloppy play coming in from Boat right there. Um, they kept bleeding numbers when they had that Uber advantage, and they wasted about a full minute. And look at this, DK immediately retaking the point, and the cap differential is huge. 44 seconds only remaining for DK, and 2.30 remaining for Boat. This is not looking good for Boat. No, not Viper and Red just like going down as well. Corsa is just doing a great job on the demo. That is for sure. Um, I noticed somebody asked why there was a play. That's because he's back home from Florida and right now. Um, Boat needs to make a play right now. They've got Aegis. That's a decent pick. And they also have uh, Bobby down. So they have to go off of this. They have to force something. There's 10 seconds Ooh. remaining in the round. And they're just sitting right there. And they're not... They're unable to move. Colcher's about to get Uber, and he has to use this. All right, he uses it. Thank God. Um, but great, great play from Billy Soros. He's denied oh so God. much. Oh, my God. He stalled that so much, and that is so good. Fusion dancing around on point, trying to get the cap, and he managed it in overtime. But I don't know how long they're going to be able to hold, to hold on to this. Uh, Boat team just trying, valiantly trying to make this happen. Carl does go down. Banfest is down as well. But uh, the ski stayed alive. Colster is alive, however, but I just don't know in the face of the DK pick class if that's going to happen. But Boar is down. Viper did get a nice headshot onto him, getting that ambi shot. And so we are maybe going to see a bit of a stall of a repush, but mm, I don't know. This is looking really intense. Um, 
Blue team coming right back in. They're trying to get some pressure. They don't have any picks to really work with. Forge is spawning. Carl goes down, so if I was DK, I would wait and see if you can maybe get a pick before going rather than forcing it and uh, do that, but I don't think they care. I think they just want to go in. They got a nice pick onto Smiles, and here's the Uber exchange coming out right now. Fusion getting most of the Uber right now, and Van going ham right now. Milks the full combo, but... Not a lot going in for DK right now. Uh, Fusion is on China right now. He's in house. He's <laughs> flanking. Oh, he's on. He's on. He's, oh my God, Skeet is so wet right now, and it does look like DK is going to be on point. Oh, it has to get in here. And Spring Rolls tried, but DK managed to get that cap, and that is going to be three one DK right now. That was an exciting last play from Fusion right there. I got really excited. <laughs> Just seeing him jump, I think, a rocket onto China and then just go through house almost two-shotting skis, but not, not enough, and that'll be 3-1. Um, great play coming in from Dunn and Kruger. They're showing why they're second in plat and why they are one of the favorites to win first place this season. Just overall dominating performance right now. Absolutely. I'm going to be taking a look at Law, and I oh my just gosh. I want to see how huge Boar went. Oh my gosh. Let's take huge. a look. Oh my god. 36 Five, frags. 517 DPM. Disgusting. 12k damage. Almost 13k damage. Followed closely by smiles in frags, but fully out damaging him. The only right justify putting out decent damage as well. Followed by Boar and Corsa, but yikes. It is gnarly stuff happening. That is remarkable to see a sniper out damage almost everybody on the server. The only person with more damage is RJ at 529, and he's doing over 13,000, but wow. Um, this. Smiles is putting in a great performance as well. It's not like one sniper is outperforming the other majorly, even though Smiles is losing the SVS 9 to 4. They're both competing with one another. The issue is just they're feeding board. Just kill after kill after kill. He's sitting pretty at four dominations. And again, 36 frags, which is... It's silly. For sure. How and much he's doing. Also, I don't think we've been giving Viper enough love, who is actually... We've been screaming about Bobby doing some great stuff, but Viper actually is out fragging him. Getting that fat 21 frags, which is pretty good. Um, he's... Gosh, above, what, most of everyone else, that's for sure. So... Man, these are some good logs. These are some real good logs. These are some great logs. Um, Viper is... He has to... As much as he did... As great as he did that first half, and as great as Smiles did, they have to kill Boar more. That's the only way I can see any semblance of coming back. Because in that one round that uh, Boat won, they were able to keep uh, Boar down a lot. And the final round, Boar had a 9k before he eventually got sniped off by Viper, but you can't let a sniper have a 9k. As hard as it is, because Boar is playing rather protected, he's playing with his team, um, you have to find some ways to kill him, because if you're just going to let a sniper stay on Viaduct, uncontested for most of the game, he's happy that he's happy to oblige, and he'll be happy to kill all of your team. Alright, I am getting word that there is a, quite a bit of a lag issue happening, so we might be seeing a switch to a different server. I'm not sure yet. I'll keep you guys filled in as I learn things which who knows when that'll happen but um here, here's one thing i want to ask is what do you want to see happening from boats to sort of change things up a bit do better other than contesting poor i feel like dunning kruger is always pushing at the right times except for maybe an ill-advised last push which took them a little too long but they still got the cap so no harm done i think that Boat needs to stop bleeding numbers when they're making their push because the one push that they had when it came on to um, when they had the uh, Uber ad is that they bled multiple numbers. They bled their heavy and then they bled their flank. And RJ is just kind of fighting on point, taking free spam as Coulter can't really follow up. And then Dunning Kruger immediately gets the Uber right after. And they fight equal Ubers. That's one thing that um, on Viaduct, you can't have that happen. You have to fight with advantage if you're going to re-push the point. And they had a massive ad. They had about, a, I think, a 30, 40 second ad, but they didn't utilize it. They let, uh, they let DK sort of kill their players, and they did not push as a team. 
And that's kind of biting them. The one round that they won, I was going to mention, um, they did not drop players in their pushes or in their yeah. defenses. They had clean. Nobody was dying and nobody could touch them. But in the last round, people just kept dying. They're bleeding too freely, and the one way you're going to beat Dunning-Kruger, if there is a chance, is you have to play smart. Absolutely, and you know, you're right, we weren't seeing a lot of that happening, but just between keeping Boar in the respawn and not bleeding players before and after those Uber pushes is what really gave them that one round. And I understand that, you know, pushing is a lot easier on Viaduct just because you have that respawn advantage. You can't, you can't waste it. You can't have your entire team, or half of your team, looking at a respawn cabinet at any given time. It's the main failing, I think, of the last round was when Coldster just lost everyone and had to back up and lose his advantage. He had 100%, he was ready to go, ready to Uber and onto the point, and yet everyone just sort of folded like a card table around him. Yeah, they just... The heavy died on Cliff, and suddenly there's no help for RJ, who's fighting on point. And Coulter did not pop the Uber smartly because if he wasted his Uber and just uh, RJ, it would have been a worse situation. But they have to play off one another way better than they have been. And I have faith in both. I feel like they can take another round if they just believe that they can, and if they believe uh, in each other, and they don't bleed numbers. But with how it's looking, four. <laughs> I, I, I'm unsure if anybody can contest him. Would you say Boar is going ham? He's got the Ooh. whole hog going for him. Ooh, sorry, that was really bad. I'm sorry, Chad. But Boar has just been walking wherever he wants, and it's hard to contest a sniper of this caliber. I'm not saying that I can do it. I'm not saying that a lot of teams can do it. There's probably no team other than K and D that can probably do that. But if they're going to find more rounds, they have to find a way. They have to find a way to neutralize him, because the more Boar gets more frags, the worse it is going to be for you. For sure. It does look like we are having a bit of a wait while the teams decide on a different server or not. So uh, let's chill out. Let's cut to a little bit of music while we wait and see what's going on. And we will catch you guys after the half. Nobody's picking up any frags, but it does look like Vand is going to be sort of trying to inch his way across the point right here. Smiles gets taken out super early by Bobby, and then Aegis picks up Fusion right justified down as well by Boar. And that is going to be a wash as DK just sort of walks onto the point, getting a lot of frags, only losing their spy. That was so good. That was really great from DK, what we just saw. Only losing Bobby, I think, right there, and just absolutely just proving why they are the second best team in the entire division. Clean play. I mean, who knows? By the end of the season, they may be the first best. Depends on what they do against DK. Um, we are seeing a little bit of pushing on the flank right here. Fusion trying to get a little bit of ag aggressive, but that's not going to be happening. Smiles did take down Van, and the Uber does come out. Fusion and Right Justify trying to get in here, but they are bumping faces with Corsa and Skeeth, and people are just folding Carl down. Uh, Bobby down, Spring rolls down as well. Ooh, later, Viper getting a nice stab in on Corsa. That is going to be so huge as Boat is going to retake this point. Finally, a great push coming in from Boat right there. They played off one another, and this is a pretty good time. Generally on Viaduct, you don't want to let the other team cap for too long. So 50 seconds on the cap time for DK, that's totally fine. Let's see what Boat can do. Um, we saw some good picks coming in from Vipa. We saw some good play coming in from Carson, and that needs to continue as look at this dk does not show any fear they're just going right back in 
absolutely not. Penguin jumping really deep, trying to get something up. Billy Sora is getting that nice crit flare onto him. Good job, absolutely denying him, protecting Ski. We are seeing that gradual repush, throwing out a lot of damage. Of course, doing a great job. Ooh, later. Bobby getting a nice stab onto Carson as he tries to back up, and the Uber does come out from Coldster. Trying to get in on here, and oh my god, Spring Roll's actually getting really deep into the DK combo. Very nice job right there, Just kind of sowing some mayhem, and Smiles actually gets bored right there in the aftermath. Nice shot from him. Um, that was interesting to see Spring Rolls run all the way up. That forced three players back as uh, they were trying to protect skis from the flames, and I believe that was a huge play coming in from Spring Rolls. Great play to get his team the space that they need. Bobby looks like he's trying to get into position right now for another stab. Uh, Blue Uber's out right now, and Red's just going to back right back up. Oh, no, absolutely not. Oh my god, right just by getting shot by Boar. Smiles hitting at Vand right there, but DK's going to be able to take this point fairly well. Uh, Viper is behind. I don't know if he's been caught out. He has, it does look like Aegis is looking for him. But uh, Coldstar has quite a significant advantage going on right here. He's going to be hitting 100% really soon. And like we mentioned at half, his team really needs to work together and not drop as many players as have been happening. But I do know both Right Justify and Carson like to play extremely aggressively. So we're just going to have to see how this kind of pans out as they are moving into position to push. Looks like the red team's getting ready to go. If there's a time to go, now is the time. Here we go. They pop red. Red pops Uber. They get Corsa early on, so which is going to force the blue team to back off. Points going back to Boat. Solid push right there from Boat. Uh, only bad side is Boar picks up Smiles. He's on the 4K right now, and that is never a good sign to see a sniper starting to get on his roll. Absolutely not, and Skeez is at 100% Uber. We are going to be seeing a repush. Fan gets taken down really early right there, but Fusion is down as well. Boar getting that, uh, picking up that fifth frag in his 5K. So we are seeing a bit of DK aggression on their cliff right now, and it does look like Boat is just ready to back out whenever necessary. The clock is ticking down, and both teams are at a pretty even amount of time on point. Here we go, DK flooding across the point. Right here, Ski's getting aggressive with his demo and scout. Spring Rolls gets taken down, Viper gets found out by Billy Soros right there. He's not going to be able to make anything happen. Here we go, big bomb in by Aegis, but Coldster makes it out. Uh, very nice, he grabbed that pack. He is still alive, and both teams have their Uber. So we're going to see how this happens, and oh, ouch, fusion. Boar just has your number this game. That's gotta hurt. Yeah, I'm seeing so many picks on a uh, fusion oh. by Boar. This is like the it's the humiliating Bobby. to keep getting. Oh, no. <laughs> oh Bobby, right forced by Vance. Oh my God. Oh right, justify getting roasted by Bobby right there, and Colts Uber getting forced. It is a solo Uber onto Carson, and Bobby is still alive and takes down Smiles as well. That is so good, just putting that pressure on. The counter Uber did come out from DK, but you know, with all the time that wasted, Colster getting into position, just getting absolutely roasted. The DK is... DK only has 22 seconds left. Yeah, only 20 seconds left. Um, this is definitely not looking favorable for Poe. If there is a time to get a pick, if there's a time to be a hero, now is the time. They have to do something. Smiles has to get a pick. Somebody has to do something. They'll pick up Bobby. That's not too bad. And now they need to get on point. They can't beat Fusion right now, and he's down. And Spring Girls goes down. Penguin is down. This is not looking good. Oh, Spade Slick trying to cap that point. Oof. Ouch. And Right Justify is down by Boar's hand as well. Again, Smiles down. Coldster down. Van going a little bit huge right there. And here we go. That is the round for DK. And the game. And the game. 4 1, DK. Not even 4 2 like you predicted. Not Yikes. even. Looks like Boat wasn't able to bring it, but um, that last round was a lot better than the last round of the, uh, the last round of the first half. Was way worse than that last round. Boat put up a good fight in the second half. Um, they were able to make some good plays, but in the end, it's boar. Five, four. It's right. just it's it's boar. Gonna take a look at the logs for the second half right here, and we are gonna see boar, Carl, and Bobby, top three fraggers on their team. And in terms of damage, that's going to be Boar and Corsa hitting out that 702 and 535 DPM respectively. There's just not much you can do against something like that when you have that much of a lock happening on your main classes, you know? Yeah. Losing Brick and losing Rogue is huge, and it's kind of hard when you have to play in a new combo. Carson and Cole 
Shocker. Two very good TF2 players, oh, yeah. as we all know. Um, could definitely handle themselves, and I'm not saying it's impossible, but when you're down your main combo and you only have your demo, it's really hard. And it's also really hard when you have to play against Boar. Just straight up. <laughs> I, can't men I cannot mention it enough. He absolutely was dominant this game. Super impressive stuff that we saw from him. Um, this is the reason why I think now DK has... They're going to be scary for Candy, and Boar is going to be one of the big reasons. Absolutely. And just, I wish that Boat put as much pressure on DK as they did the first few rounds, where they just had Skis' number. Skis dropped twice in, during the first half, but it just, nobody could really follow up. People got picked off, and so on and so forth. And here we go. Dunning Kruger keeps on moving up, and we'll see what happens with the lower brackets on Thursday. So, congratulations to Dunning Kruger. You guys have earned yourself a nice, at least third place medal. I'm sure you guys will go for the second place, or the first place. I'll say you're aiming first. Um, and solid stuff. Boat is going to be playing, I believe, BV or EVL on Thursday, but this time they're going to have their full roster back. So expect Brick, expect Rogue, expect the captain to be back on his ship. <laughs> for sure. And thank you so much, Zoe, for casting on such short notice. Um, if Chad could give a little bit of love for Zoe, it's always nice to have a new caster in the booth with me. That's for sure, especially for playoffs. Thank you, thank you. It was a pleasure casting with you. Do you have any shout-outs for us? I would like to... Uh, I have a few shout-outs. I'd like to first shout-out Brick. Um, I'm better than you. I'd also <laughs> like to shout-out um, my boy, my boys on Delisi, who I do not know the results between Kid Warrior and Delisi, but I hope they won, because... Fingers crossed. Fingers are crossed that they won. Uh, and yeah, that's it. All right. Well, big thank you to both teams, as always, doing a great job. And thanks, chat, for turning out and watching some video games with us. And thanks, Jerry Soul, for running the camera. You do a pretty good job. Thank you, Jerry. <laughs> so uh, be sure the link to the EBL YouTube where all the VODs are going to be uploaded is down below the video player. Uh, check out the website, evl.gg. We do post what we're going to be casting, the results of matches, how our other sponsored teams are doing, so on and so forth. Uh, just throwing that out there. It's not like I update the website or anything. Anyway, thank you all so much for turning out, and you guys have a great night.